board really wants to create the car that cares. And we were introduced to health and wellness a number of years ago when uh, Etzel Ford, who's a member of the Ford family and on the board of directors, worked with Medtronic because his son was diabetic and he was interested in the technology that they were developing, in particular a continuous glucose monitor. So we started working with them years ago and what we tried to do is to merge the medical devices that come into the car with the connectivity system that we created, which is called Sync. For many of the listeners, Sync is a system that enables you to connect your phone and your MP3 player. It's primarily concerned with infotainment. And what we wanted to do is fundamentally change the paradigm of Sync move it away from just purely infotainment into health and wellness. But most people go through their entire driving lives without ever being in a serious auto accident. But if they have chronic illness, they suffer from that every day of their lives. Mm -hmm. So if we really are interested in automotive safety, we want to broaden that definition to incorporate those issues which are really relevant to people on a daily basis. So let's say you're diabetic and you have a continuous glucose monitor device. Uh -huh. Now that only not only gives you the, your blood, pro, your blood uh, sugar level now, but it also shows which way you're trending. And that piece of information is equally critical because you need to know if you're headed towards a problem in advance so that you can take corrective action. That's particularly important if you're driving a vehicle because not only are you a danger to yourself, but you're a danger to others on the road with you. So let's say you're driving and you might start to feel a little low. You want to check on that. Well, if you have your device and it's a winter day, you have a winter coat on, you're not going to reach inside. And we don't want you doing that. We don't want you reaching in, trying to find a device that takes your eyes off the road and your hands off the wheel, which we believe is critical for safety. But with Sync, you could press a button and simply ask for the reading. It would communicate to the device, the device would tell it what the reading is, and it would verbalize it for you in the car. It would tell you your reading. Let's say you're not the diabetic, but your child is, and they're in the back seat, and they appear to be sleeping. Maybe they are sleeping, but maybe they're going into a diabetic coma. How would you know? Again, with the push of the sync button, you could query the device and get that reading safely while you're driving the vehicle. A, a tremendous peace of mind for the parent of a diabetic child, which could be enabled by coupling this technology, this medical technology, with the connectivity capability that sync provides inside the vehicle.